Typically, when we think about alfalfa in Oklahoma, we're re really thinking about forage, but Kelly, there's also seed production in regards to alfalfa as well. Yeah, we, we uh, have seen a decline in the last several years, previous years we've seen a decline, but in the last several years we've seen an uptick in interest for seed production. So we wanted to throw it out there that uh, if you are interested in seed production, there's some things to keep in mind as far as insects uh, to look at when you're looking at seed production. So let's dive right into there. What, what type of insects are really going to impact seed production? Well, when we think about insects for alfalfa seed production, uh, we're really focusing on uh, the, the timing issue of, of, of seed production because our main insect pest in uh, seed production for alfalfa is the alfalfa seed chalcid. The, the chalcid is a t small, tiny uh, wasp, about a, a tenth of an inch, so it's not very big. Its activity in May and June, it builds, builds in population throughout the summer, with its peak time being in about uh, late August through September. So the problem with this pest is it actually lays its eggs in the, in the seed pods in the seed. And so, uh, and it does its damage from inside out. And so that makes our chemical applications pretty ineffective. And we, we, we just have to, we just can't really control it any other way. So we have to look at uh, timing and some other management strategies to be, be able to control this particular pest. So we look at uh, management issues like uh, mowing the borders, like we see right here, mowing the borders, uh, keeping the, the uh, volunteer down, keeping the habitat down for the potential increase of this particular pest throughout the summer as much as possible. Then the, the main thing we look at is harvest timing. When we look at harvest timing for alfalfa seed, we, we're looking at about a 10 week window. We, we, we typically harvest in May, our first harvest is in May, and then our new growth for the second crop usually comes on about uh, and starts flowering about mid-June. So that's the point where we start, we just leave the crop and the pollination begins. And so pollination starts or keeps on going through about uh, the, the mid to late June. Seed sets early all, all, uh, July and then it dries, matures, and we're ready for harvest around the first part of August. And so that gives us a time frame to harvest before the, the highest populations of chalcid begins. It, the problem is if we wait and, and har or try to harvest a little bit too early, we run the risk of not having enough pollinators out here to, to, to do their job and, and help us get the seed set. Again, if we wait too late, we run the risk of having a high population of uh, chalcids when we try to harvest. And if that is the case, we could lose as much as 80 or more percent of the crop. Wow. So, so, so we, it, timing is really crucial for this particular pest. Is there other insects that can also impact the alfalfa as well? During this time frame, we're really concerned about, during, during this uh, pollination time frame about mid-June, we're really concerned about grasshoppers and also plant bugs under the genus Ligus. Uh, both of them really like flowering structures and, and the flower and can really do some significant damage if uh, they, they feed on those structures and cause leaf drop, uh, uh, flower drop, leaf drop, and can really do some significant damage during this time frame if we don't get them under control. Now is the key time to be able to control them before they get too big and, and get more mobile and harder to control. Uh, the thing about, think about that is, we talked about forage uh, alfalfa a while ago, the threshold in forage alfalfa is about, we, we kind of walk the borders of the field and we, if we see about 15 to 20 uh, hoppers flying up, that's a good threshold number, uh, kind of an estimate. But for seed production, it's, it's about half that or less. And you also have a fact sheet that people can go to to, to yeah, we have Yeah, we have a fact sheet uh, uh, managing insect pests and alfalfa, uh, uh, I think it's current report 7150. EPP 7150. All right, thanks, Kelly. Kelly Seuss, Extension Alfalfa Specialist here at Oklahoma State University. And if you would like a link to the fact sheet Kelly mentioned, go to our website, sunup.okstate.edu.